We're starting now. <laughs> okay. So welcome everyone, and I appreciate your time. Like I said in the invite, this is going to be fun, but it's also going to be informative. I promise it won't be a waste. Not that you have a lot of places to go because here in Florida, we're still in major lockdown. I mean, okay, Denise got a petty. Um, maybe you got your hair done. Maybe I got mine done, but still really we're in lockdown. So I'm going to introduce my friend Christy in a minute, but let me just tell you, okay. I have to take you on a visual tour because everyone's like, oh, are you selling? Are you making money? Well, I do represent this product, but I haven't done a very good job in years. And I want to show you what I recently dug out of my cupboard once I start. Yes, this is my bathroom. These are just, I would say, maybe one half to one, probably one third of the products that I've tried for my face. For my, I mean, you can see my everything for my face. face. Nerium to Arbonne, who oh, is it echoing? It is my it phone, is my I'm phone. sorry. No, you're anyway, fine. I'll go. I'll go away. So my point is, my face is super sensitive. So anytime I put anything on my face, literally it turns fire engine red the minute it hits it. So I've tried, you name it, from drugstore like um, redness relief um i've tried i'm looking at them arbonne because i support my friends that have businesses i've tried miriam drunk elephant which everyone is raving about on some site and i'm like oh drunk elephant is that a cute name paid gobs of money and it did work it definitely cleaned my skin but it left it red um i've tried CeraVe. i've tried ole henriksen I, I mean, I could go on and on and on. Um, that man that sells the, you know, oh, it's all based on vitamins line, Peter Brandt, blah, blah, blah. So when I joined, um, tried this, the hero product of Life Vantage, which is the little yellow pill, some of you guys are on it, ProTandem, I totally forgot they had a skincare line. And in lockdown, a bunch of girls that are on these pages were on, were doing the skincare line and they were posting pictures. I'm like, Oh, I think I have that. So I dug it out of the cupboard, literally, where all that other product I just showed you was. And it's super simple, you guys. It's a cleanser. It's a perfecting lotion, what they call, and then a regular um, lotion. And I started using it, and I couldn't believe it. I'm like, what was I thinking? I mean, this has been under the cupboard. It, at first, my skin was a little red the first time, but then within days, it was cleared up. And right now... I have a little eyebrow and a little mascara, but basically nothing else. You can still see I have a red tone. Um, when I did my video for my new job, a lot of people's like, what have you been doing? Not nothing. I mean, I've been in lockdown for March, April, May, and all I've done is try to stick to a routine of cleansing my face in the morning, using the perfecting, and then at night, I did just buy though, because everyone was raving about it, the eye serum. So I started using the eye serum, which I adore. And I just thought, well, I should tell my friends because everyone's telling me where to get toilet paper and where to get hand sanitizer. And, you know, oh, I'm supporting my little business friends. I've bought earrings. I've bought a uh, mask. I've bought all these things. And I thought, you know what? I'm just going to have a little beauty party. And Christy, because she is a medical esthetician, you guys, so it doesn't come from somebody who is just like, oh, I love this product. She ran up, owned a Medi Spa, works in a Medi Spa. She knows her stuff. So I said, do you mind getting on just for a few minutes and kind of talking about the line, but also helping us with tips in lockdown, how to look good in lockdown. I mean, in Zooms, because a lot of you guys have business um, meetings on Zoom, but also once you emerge like the, you know, caterpillar from its shell, how can we all look better after all this? So that's kind of my intro, Christy Vogt. Like I said, is a medical esthetician. She's also super healthy, lives in Colorado. I mean, ultimate, like her and her husband are world-class skiers, water skiers. They actually come to Okahili, for those of you in West Palm, for the world championships every year of water ski. So what a small world that is. Um, so I really trust what she says, and I want her to just share some fun facts. Christy, my friend, I'll go on mute now. I love fun facts. You forgot to tell everybody that I'm 85. <laughs> right. I was going to leave that part out. Well, she is partially, you know, Asian. So you know how they don't age. So that's partial. But really, it's her healthy living that I attempt to live. 
<laughs> Hi guys, thank you, Tony. So yes, I live in Colorado and I started off as a medical esthetician, which just means, you know, working alongside physicians, doing really fancy, expensive treatments, uh, lasers and uh, Botox and peels and all of that. Oh gosh, 22 years ago, I was in my 30s. I'm 50, almost 54 now. Um, and so I have the person in my chair and I'm doing treatments on them and just, I love helping people feel beautiful and look beautiful. I love it so much. And so I'm just listening to their stories and it didn't take me long to figure out, wow, like everybody pretty much has the same concerns. It doesn't matter how old the person is or where they're from, male or female, how much money they have, you know, how many treatments that they can get. It doesn't really matter. Everyone has the same health concerns. And then so I started really listening and connecting the dots, like what they were telling me to what I was seeing on the face, like wrinkles and sunspots and, and breakouts and rashes. And um, I, I just thought that was so fascinating. And then fast forward about six years, I started off with a dermatologist. Then I went to a plastic surgeon who was way ahead of his time in anti-aging, you guys. And some of you might really understand this if you're on bioidentical hormones or no friends who have. He was doing bioidentical hormones. So I started working for him in 2004. He was already doing it for 15 years. He was so far ahead of the game. And um, the, right when I started working for him in 2004, he sent me to Chicago to this anti-aging seminar. And back then, anti-aging wasn't really a thing. There weren't that many physicians practicing like anti-aging. And I, I was there when all of these scientists first discovered that at the root of all disease and aging, there was one common thread, and that was inflammation. Cellular stress slash inflammation, same thing. And so it was then that I just shifted gears to, okay, it doesn't matter how beautiful we are in the end, it matters like what's going on in the inside so we can have just, you know, feel good, have a quality of life and enjoy everything that we love to do and still be beautiful all at the same time. But we can't just have a beautiful outside and not have a beautiful inside. So I've got some biohacking secrets for you. Um, for you both. I'm just muting you guys out. Okay, so all, I don't know if you guys have heard the word biohacking, but biohacking just simply means taking control of our own biology doing things that like our bodies recognize and it just helps to make them work better, function better. And by doing that, we're going to slow down the aging process and we are going to, that skin is the largest organ on our body and it's a direct reflection of what's going on inside. So we, you know, I'm going to give you some secrets for the outside, but also, you know, we want to be glowing and radiant and have like a healthy skin color. Even if you're living in Florida, um, you can get that from what's going on in the inside. So get ready. So basically, if you think about really any skin concern, whether it's acne or rosacea, eczema, psoriasis, you guys, brown spots, you know, the, the seborrheic keratosis kind of the liver spots that people called them back in the day. Seriously, wrinkles, uh, bags under the eyes, skin cancers, that's all inflammation. And it is really coming from the inside, not so much the outside, but the inside. And so some things that actually cause systemic inflammation coming from the inside and, and aging, right? And just, disease skin is like gluten, you know, gluten has such a bad name. And I know like Tony, you travel to Europe and stuff and their gluten products, their wheats and breads are so much different, but really the problem with gluten here is in the United States is really just the way it's processed. And it's not like the ancient grain, but anyway, so kind of glutinous products can cause inflammation if they're not good quality. Um, casein, which is a protein in milk, 
So any kind of dairy product, you know, that, that has a derivative of milk, so milk and ice cream, and I'm sorry, um, and, you know, cheese, um, that is an, an inflammatory food. And trust me, I love my cheese. The hard, stinky cheese is actually better than kind of the soft cheeses, just FYI. Um, and then a lot of um, different oils, like safflower, sunflower, soy, and corn that you, you get in a lot of processed foods. And then just like unhealthy meats, you know, with a lot of nitrates in them, the, the, the preserved and processed meats, um, we, fried food, and of course, sugary stuff, and then fast food. So that's all causing inflammation, which can trigger all these inflammatory skin diseases and just cause our skin to age way quicker. Um, also, stress and not sleeping well. I mean, raise of hands. Like, who, who is not who is not sleeping? I mean, there's a lot of you know, and, and a lot of that comes from hormonal issues as well. But just not sleeping and being stressed, and of course, being dehydrated, not just drinking clean, clean water, and then medications. So whether it's just taking like ibuprofen, sleeping aids, um, you know, anxiety meds, one course of antibiotics destroy our gut for an entire year, and really, really bad supplements, you guys, just like the supplements that you would pull off of Costco shelves, um, you know, multivitamins, antioxidant vitamins that you know people are trying to supplement what the foods that they're not eating and so really high doses of like vitamins a and c and e are doing more harm to our body than good and it, it really affects our skin and our aging processes so what is happening we are being hijacked i want you to think like way before the industrial revolution so you know our grandparents great grandparents generations before that their environment was so different they lived more off the land they grew their own foods they were outside more they were eating from locally sourced farms you know they didn't have the processed foods and the herbicides and pesticides you guys our soil is really supposed to give us health benefits, soil. So uh, vitamin B12, you've probably heard of that. I actually supplement with the vitamin B12. That's supposed to be in our soil and different minerals, um, which is, are good for our skin. Are, it's depleted now. So back in the day, before it was depleted, like fruits and vegetables that grew from the soil and even animals, you know, that ate um, grasses from the soil. They were getting all these nutrients that were being passed on to us, but that is not happening anymore. And of course, we're exposed to all of these computers and phones and microwaves and all of that, right? So we are being hijacked and our body is not keeping up with keeping, with um, slowing down that aging process that's happening from being hijacked. I'm trying to keep this super simple and not really sciencey. <laughs> so let's talk about biohacking secrets. Again, doing things that our bodies recognize and that gets triggered to just function better. And therefore, you're going to just have healthier skin. You're going to slow down the aging process. So um, 13 foods for fabulous skin. I put this together this morning just for you. Um, but the first one, if, if you can't tell, that is actually really clean fatty fish, so salmon and mackerel, fish that comes from cold water, has lots of fat in it, and that is really great for our skin to keep it hydrated and collagen. Um, by the way, collagen supplements and any collagen drink, they don't work. Collagen is made in our bodies by our bodies, so we want to eat foods that help promote collagen synthesis. So fatty salmon is one, and clean, make sure, you know, it's um, it's not farm raised and um, a lot of fish has chemicals and um, heavy metals in it. So just, you know, make sure you're getting it from a good source. And then really fatty, healthy foods like avocados. Who, who doesn't like avocados? They're such a big deal now. Like avocado toast. Oh, so good. Um, 
walnuts. Walnuts are really good for our skin. And berries, you know, raspberries and blackberries and blueberries, those really beautiful color berries, really good for our skin. And nuts and seeds. So this, these little spoons right here are supposed to be seeds, like sunflower seeds, really anti-inflammatory, great for our skin. Gives so Seeds, especially sunflower and pumpkin seeds, you guys, have vitamins and minerals in it that we really can't get from other food sources. So sprinkle seeds, you know, on whatever you're eating. Um, I make a chai, a dirty chai shake in the morning, actually, and put seeds in it. Um, and then this, these are not very good pictures, but this other circle right here is actually sweet potatoes, yams, the, the orange ones, which are yams, but most of us call them sweet potatoes. They are so good. Yams and carrots, anything orange and yellow and red, so good. Did you know that orangey foods actually promote that orangey kind of glow, like healthy tan? Um, there was a Time Magazine article, and I'll, I want to find it. Um, I haven't seen it for a while. But there was a Time Magazine article that had these, these pale-faced women. <laughs> and then they had them eat just foods with lots of bright oranges, like sweet potatoes, yams, um, and carrots, and even oranges, and bell peppers. And then by the end of, I think it was like four to six weeks, not being exposed to the sun at all, they had like a, a orangey glow to their skin, like it was tanned. So it were, I'm telling you. Um, and then broccoli, and broccoli is very anti-cancer, you guys. So I hope you're eating lots of broccoli. Broccoli is actually a NERF2 activator, which I'm gonna talk about here in a minute. Um, but broccoli and cauliflower, cru cruciferous vegetables are so good for our skin. And then tomatoes. Tomatoes actually have lycopene. And I remember watching Dr. Oz when he was back on Oprah Winfrey. I don't know if you remember that. So that was years ago. Um, he was telling us about this test that they did with these women from like Norway. Again, very pale, photosensitive um, skin types. Put them under a UV light for like 10 minutes and of course they burned, they got really pink and red and burned. Then for one full month, um, he had them just eat, a, it was like a half of a, excuse me, a quarter of a cup of cooked tomatoes. So cooked tomatoes release the lycopene. And so salsa, if you guys like salsa, that's cooked tomatoes, the cooked kind of salsa. Um, and like tomato sauces for Italian people like um, Tony, that should be easy. So a quarter cup only every day for a month, then they put those same women under the UV lights again and their skin actually did not burn. So it gives us actually a, um, you know, a sun protection from the inside out. And then dark green leafy, vegetables like kale and spinach and chard, really good for us. And then this circle here is chocolate. Yes, I know you would love me for this one, but dark chocolate contains a lot of great antioxidants. Um, you know, dark chocolate, you probably know this, but it doesn't contain the sugar. Milk chocolate, they add milk, they add sugar to it, but pure dark chocolate um, is actually has full of antioxidants. So feeding our skin um, and healthy for our skin. And then this is green tea. And then the 13th food is red grapes. And so I threw in some red wine there, why not? Because I know y'all like wine. So those are kind of the top 13 foods to help promote um, good skin health, very anti-inflammatory, like I said, giving our, our skin um, anti-aging effects. And then um, also this, oh, whoops, didn't mean to go there yet, hold on. This gut right here. Gut health, you guys, is so important. It's actually number one. You know, Hippocrates said, he knew this way back when, that all disease starts in the gut. So I can tell when I'm treating someone's skin if they have an unhealthy gut, and you guys, most of us do. And I'm sure that most of you guys are already taking a really good probiotic because we know that an unhealthy gut leads to an unhealthy brain. So think like dementia and Alzheimer's and Parkinson's and anxiety and depression. An unhealthy gut leads to weight gain. Our guts are not able to absorb good nutrients from food. And an unhealthy gut leads to a poor immune system. One course of antibiotics, so even if you took it 
took them when you were seven years old destroys our gut health for one full year. And it's really, really hard to bring that back, guys. So we need to be in a probiotic. So good gut health equals good skin health. And then good, clean water. Um, so I know I'm going to just say this because we have family in Florida. A lot of family live in Orlando. I've been to West Palm Beach, love it so much. But a lot of people are just drinking all those, the bottled water. You guys, the bottled water, most of us get just off the shelf, contains a lot of acidity and it's not really clean. It's too clean and too pure. It doesn't have any minerals in it. So do some research and just find a source where you can get good, clean water that has the minerals in it. Um, and I'll give you my secret. Um, I, I'm going to show you what we do. We spend some money on this, so no judging. But And we have good water here in Colorado. But there is Mountain Valley Spring Water. Comes, it's sourced from Oklahoma. And we get it by the, can you see? It's a five-gallon glass jug. <clears throat> we, we get it delivered. Whoops. Sorry, this is a shit show. Okay, my slideshow. We get it delivered to us, and that's what we drink. And it is just, it comes straight from the source. Um, you guys can find it in Whole Foods. You've probably seen it. It's in a green glass bottle if you buy it in the liters. And it has all of the minerals that we need, and it's clean, and it's alkaline. So we want an alkaline environment in our guts. Again, it's going to promote good, healthy skin, okay? Top secret. Okay, and then if we, we put um, lemon in our water, that's gonna give us some um, alkalinity too, and lemon and citrus fruits are so good for our skin. Of course, exercise. I know Tony doesn't like to exercise, but even if she does some stretches, maybe on some leg lifts in her, on her living room floor, a few sit-ups, just get the circulation going. Good circulation obviously is going to help um, bring color into the skin and promote um, more anti-aging benefits and then good quality sleep. So just make sure, you know, you can do some studies on what to do for good sleep, but you know, you want to like turn off the cell phone, not have this in your room and turn off all of the um, LED lights and all of that. And so you can biohack your sleep too. And then taking really good supplements. So this is what I am going to talk to you about too, is just taking good quality things, newer technology of supplements that our bodies actually, again, function better because of it. So that's when I'm going to move on now. So I want you guys to really think about this seriously. I know uh, some of you might be taking the little yellow pill. You've heard Tony talk about the little yellow pill. So if I told you, if you don't know anything about the little yellow pill, but you might not know this, but here it is right here, for Tannin Nerf 2. This little yellow pill, you guys, our National Institutes of Aging, it's a government program. Its whole objective is to figure out how to help Americans live longer and age slower. So they do studies all the time. They study, this is the only pill that they study for 10 years, federally funded study. They studied this, they studied turmeric all by itself because they knew that was healthy for us. They studied green tea all by itself, resveratrol, which comes from grape seed skin, and fish oils. 10-year federally funded study. After 10 years, they proved that protanin is the only thing they've studied so far that actually extends quality of life in male mammals. That's an average of four to six years in a human being because it keeps that oxidative stress, that inflammation, which is the root of all aging, all disease. It keeps it at an all-time low as long as you take it every single day for the rest of your life or however long you take it. It's going to keep oxidative stress levels low. So it's going to lower our risk for disease. It's going to slow down aging. I'm going to show you some photos here in a minute to prove it. And um, it is the most studied product in a pill form in nutraceutical ever done. We've, it's been studied since 2003. So over here on the right, you can see the Ohio State, Virginia Commonwealth, um, Harvard, American Heart Association, you guys, they did their own self-funded study on this. So this is real. It contains these five plant ingredients that have a synergistic effect because the way it's formulated in this to actually lower that oxidative stress and extend life, and it's 50 bucks. So 
taking things like this along with eating well and all the other things I told you about um, will help improve the, the aging process. Um, and then this is it again. Um, so you see glutathione, I'm not gonna get super sciencey, but increasing glutathione by 300%. Glutathione is our mother of all antioxidants. Remember all those beautiful foods that I showed you that we need to eat to keep inflammation down and promote good, healthy skin? Those are antioxidant um, fruits and vegetables. So glutathione is our mother of all antioxidants. And what happens when we take this is that it actually activates our cells to make their own antioxidants. So way more powerful than even eating antioxidants because our cells are making them, increasing glutathione by 300%. If you know somebody that says they're taking glutathione supplements because they know it's an anti it's anti aging, it's not working and it's expensive pee. Our glutathione's made in our bodies by our bodies, just like collagen is. Our bodies have to produce it. So taking this will help to produce the glutathione. It's ridiculous. That's why we're so excited about this. And, and Tony loves her friends. And really, friends don't let friends have oxidative stress, period. Um, and so some of you might be saying, well, I drink green tea every day, you know, or I go get green tea lattes and I sprinkle uh, turmeric on everything, which is this cucumin here. That's great. But this, this pill, the way it's formulated, and the magic is in activating nerve too. So it's 18 fold more. Um, more potent than taking the individual ingredients. So here it is, um, eating antioxidants, great for you. It's neutralizing those free radicals that are causing that inflammation in our body, one to one. One antioxidant to one free radical. Taking this little yellow pill is one to one million. So huge, huge difference. That's why we're so excited. So let's talk about <clears throat> the probiotic that you may or may not be taking. So we know yogurt say that they contain probiotics and kombucha, I love kombucha, I drink it all the time. I like it because of the taste, but I don't do it for the probiotic effect. Sauerkraut has probiotics, right? We need to do everything we can to get good gut health. Most probiotics die when they hit the stomach acid. So our probiotic is in spheres and it goes through the stomach acid, time released, to get the good healthy bacteria to our small and large intestine. So this is absolutely gonna help protect your immune system, build your immune system, um, help you lose weight um, around the belly, this and the nerve too, that oxidative stress, and you can absorb good nutrients when you eat good food. So this is a really big deal. This is actually my second favorite product after the nerve too. Um, we take it on an empty stomach, my husband and I, before we go to bed with the prebiotic that we have. And you guys, I, I, my, I sleep better, stomach is settled, it feels flatter when I wake up, and totally more regular. So we all need to be pooping on a regular basis. And then fish oils. So good quality fish, like I said, if you're not consuming good, healthy, fatty fish, remember I told you how that's one of the top 13 things for a healthy skin. If you're not, we want do want to supplement with good fatty fish, help with heart, skin, joints, all of that. And if you think about, um, I know most of you probably have tried some fish oils before, and then you have fishy burps. Think about if you went to a restaurant, and I know you in uh, West Palm Beach have really amazing restaurants. Um, avocado grill is my favorite. But if you eat a piece of fish and you go home and you're burping up rancid fish burps like you do with your fish oil capsules that you take, wouldn't you think, oh my gosh, that was a bad piece of fish. I'm calling the restaurant and I'm getting my money back or I'm never going there again. Well, we need to be thinking about that with our fish oils. So many fish oils are just filled with all sorts of crap and fillers and um, they're not tested for purity and potency and any kind of heavy metals. And this is, and it's only coming from Alaska cod and Norwegian pollock. So that's all I want to talk about the inside, feeding our skin antioxidants, reducing inflammation, and um, good quality fish and a good quality probiotic. So other than that, this is the true science that <clears throat> Tony was mentioning. And so you know this little yellow pill, what they did back in the day is they crushed it. All the scientists are like, okay, if this is doing such a great job in, on cellular health inside, let's crush it. Let's make a paste and let's see what it does on the outside of the skin. So they were doing it and they were seeing all sorts of amazing things happening. Brightening effects, um, reducing inflammation, reducing like skin cancers. 
And um, so what they did is they made the anti-aging cream. That was actually our second product in all of our line was the anti-aging cream. So it's the little yellow pill for our skin. Um, so now we have a beautiful cleanser. It's like a creamy, it's milky and gel based and a perfecting lotion, which is like a toner and serum all in one. It's my favorite. It preps your skin for the anti-aging cream and then a really good eye serum. By the way, Tony, put that eye serum around your lips and it's going to help actually with the lines around the lips. Not that you have lines, but if you did, it would help with that. Um, so beautiful skincare line, you guys. And, it, and I have been in medical aesthetics, like I said, for 22 years, worked with the best of the best of the best. I'm still working. I just got off work, actually. Um, I work Wednesdays because I still, I love it so much. I love my patients. And <clears throat> I've worked with the best of the best skincare. You guys, there's so many chemicals out there causing inflammation in the skin to help promote collagen synthesis. This is actually promoting collagen synthesis better than Retin-A, which is chemical-based, um, and without an inflammatory response. So it's new technology in skincare, I promise you. Take before photos before you try any of our stuff because things will change over time. Any skin type, so dry, young, old, oily, acneic, can use this skin line, it's beautiful. So younger looking skin, brighter, luminous, more hydrated, smoother, it's a great line. And it's everything this Nerf 2 is. It's turmeric, milk thistle, green tea, ashwagandha root, like who wouldn't want these ingredients in a skincare line and no chemicals. So here you go, here's proof. These are real people, I know them, um, with real results. And it's from taking the internal products that I mentioned and using our skincare line. And you can see that inflammation on the skin just calms down and wrinkles smoothing. So check this out. Boom. So this is Milena on the left. This is my last slide, you guys. Milena on the left. She lives in um, Canada. She posted this photo last year. And she said, this is me taking the products that I mentioned, plus using the skincare for four years. I had to call her out. I called her and I said, Melena, you had CO2 laser, a chemical peel and Botox at a minimum. Come on. She said, Christy, that's flattering. I promise you. And we all, we know her. I mean, she's telling the truth. This is literally what biohacking looks like, you guys, when, when it starts from the inside and you're doing everything in the inside to slow down aging and doing the right things on the outside as well. So beautiful. And then these are um, my friends. <clears throat> Tony didn't want to share her photo, but we're all mid 50s and older um, biohacking at age 50. Cute faces and no makeup, by the way. So that's all I have. Tony, do you want to pop back on? Sure. And tell me if it's really crackly because I'm okay on my end. Um, thank you, Christy. That was actually awesome. And I always forget what's like salmon. I love salmon, but I forget that it's also good for your skin. I don't love broccoli, but I feel like I really should eat more broccoli. Um, so I'm going to have, before we go on, um, if you're interested in the skincare set, um, just you guys, you can message me here. You guys all have my, I'm pretty sure everyone has my cell phone um, number or Facebook message, and I can send you a link. Um, not to be salesy, but I will say they had some Mother's Day specials that are still, I guess they extended them because they were really popular and it is the whole set. And then they, you also, if you just want the cleanser and the um, lotion, they do that. Um, I truly, guys, honest to God, I just ordered the eye serum. Um, somebody had given me the, I'm not trying to throw out names, but Rodan Fields eye serum and I didn't love it. Um, this is really great. And what I love about the cleanser, I'll be honest, I'm a big scent person. My daughter and Emily and I must have been born with really picky noses because we're very big on scents. So if I open a product and I don't like the scent, even if it's like fabulous, I can't use it. The scent on this is like this light, grapefruity, beautiful scent. I can't describe it, but all I can say is when I open it, I'm like, oh my God, it smells so good. So if you're big on scents, but it's also um, lighter. So it's not this heavy, grimy cleanser. Anyway, um, but what I wanted to say is they do have specials. I can drop, I'll drop my um, link down there. 
you have any questions, Christy can help. But I wanted to make it worth your time. So if you do order the set, like any set that's on sale, and there's several different prices, they're very affordable, especially compared to some of the stuff we buy at the stores we shop at here. Um, I have little prizes, because you know I promise prizes. So if you buy a set, I have these cute little makeup bags. Look, Christy, remember when we got these cute little makeup bags? And I'm gonna stuff them with other stuff. We didn't wanna bore you, but I do have samples of the Protandum, the little yellow pill, and the Nerf um, one, which is kind of its colleague that helps with mitochondria, that I can slip in just so you could try it for a day, make sure you like it, you know, it, it, you don't have a reaction. I also have our Axio. Okay, so I would say next to the little yellow pill, this is my second favorite product. Some of you guys already drink it. Um, so basically, it's a healthy energy drink. That's the best way to say it. It's full of vitamin B, full of all that good stuff, none of the bad stuff. But even better, because all the girls in Life Vantage love their drinkies. So right now, I'm having my favorite, and I will put this in there, guys, because I've tried every single flavor. My favorite, I know this isn't yours, Christy, but my favorite is red raspberry. And right now in this glass, I have red raspberry and a splash of vodka. So the way I, I make myself feel better is I'm drinking all this healthy stuff. So who cares if there's a splash of vodka? And we've done parties where we've served this and people love it because it's not heavy. And I figure, this is my theory, if I'm drinking all this vitamin B and good stuff, I'm not going to get a hangover. And so far, I haven't. But they also have a sour cherry. So if you like cherry lifesaver flavor, if you're really into big, powerful, sweet kind of cherry taste, Susan Loeb, it's really good. Um, I usually take this around three o'clock in the afternoon when normally like down here we have espresso or everyone runs to Starbucks at the newsroom. When I was in the newsroom, I would pop one of these. And it's fabulous. So I'm going to stuff some of those of different flavors in there. I think I have a red raspberry and a couple of other flavors. So you will get this bag of goodness from me if you buy any of the skincare deals. And they are deals. But I want to have a freebie. So look at this cute little thing. I had bought this because I was going to have a Cinco de Mayo lockdown party. And then I decided I was too lazy. So I bought these little hats. How cute are these? And it has little hot sauce. And it has some Axios in it. Okay, so this is going to be yours. If you're local, if you're not local, I can mail it to you. I have a question. So first one, I can't see everyone. So Christy's going to tell me who says first. I have a trivia question. Christy, you'll be proud of me. Christy okay. said skin is the largest organ on our body, correct? Yes, that's what I said. How? That's what you said. So how, what percentage of our weight, what percentage of our weight is our skin. You've got to give me a percentage, obviously between one and a hundred. If you know, raise your hand. Christy, you can't do it because you're a professional. What percentage? Oh yeah, type in the, in the chat. chat. Yeah, I'm, I'm Type in the chat. Right what percentage of our, oh, we have a nurse in the group with Annette Burnett. What percentage of our body weight, so if we weigh a hundred, dream on, Tony, what percentage of the 100 weight, Tina said 12. You are, you're close, close T, close. What percentage is our skin? I was shocked, to be honest. I'm like, oh, let me cut some of that skin off. Yeah. Anyone else? Can you see it? What percentage? No, no one said anything yet. Come on, an app or not. You're, Ten, no, all close. Oh, wait. Lisa said 16. Lisa said 16. Oh, 16. Lisa Doherty, you win. Lisa, 16%. 16%. I was shocked. That's a lot. Like, just think about that. If I cut some of this skin off, I wouldn't have to start myself. That's what I thought. All right, Lisa, I'm going to give this to Paula because she knows you, and she'll make sure you get this. Um, one more fun fact. Okay, this person will also get, well, you won't get a cute hat. I only have one cute hat. But you'll get some of these yummy Axios and maybe a little vodka to go along with it. Okay, my next question is, <laughs> Christy, you cannot guess because you already know. How, so we all know our skin sheds, right? Like everyone knows that because that's why they do those gross stories where they 
take the ultraviolet light on your pillow and it's like disgusting because there's all that skin in the hotel. Remember that? Anyway, so how often, how often does your skin shed? In other words, I need it in days. Is it two days, you know, three days, 99 days? I need to know how many days. Oh, very close, Denise, like super close. Oh, Lisa, close, close, but not on. No Googling. How many days? Very close. T, you're so close. Little lower, T, little lower, little lower, little lower. You guys are so close. You're like within five or 10. Oh, Denise Mariotti, 27 days. Denise, I'll bring you a fun little package and we can have drinks. We can have vodka Axios. So you win some Axio. 27 days. Who knew? So that's why it's really important, I guess, you keep up with getting it off yourself because 27 days, I thought it was much more than that, much sooner than that. I didn't know it sits there 27 days. It kind of grosses me out all that. Whole that's time. why, anyway, like a lot of so. That's why a lot of skin treatments that you do when, as we get older and we do skin treatments like microdermabrasions, you know, dermaplaning, we want to do about every, you know, 27 to 30 days to stay on top of that normal exfoliation. Because as we get older, it, it doesn't shed that quicker, quickly. So if we have an exfoliant, how often should we do it? Is it really twice a week? Well, yeah, that's more like when you go in for clinical exfoliation, like if you okay. came to Lisa, she's an esthetician or myself, and we, you know, exfoliate in a more clinical way, then that's like once a month, ideally. Um, but at home, when you're just using some type of exfoliation, depending on what it is, yeah, cut twice a week. Do, do not use, please do not use St. Ives apricot scrub, whatever you do. <laughs> Emily May, did you hear what she said? Do not use oh. St. Ives apricot scrub. I'm going to actually end the recording.